coming up short. Fucking with too short. Too short. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Today was day two of week one for my competition prep. On today's agenda was paused bench press, sumo deadlift, seated overhead press, and front squats. I didn't get the front squats in because my best friend from China uh, FaceTimed me in the middle of this extra, of, of this uh, training session and I want to talk to him, so I was kind of distracted and my front squats just didn't happen. So next week I'll get those. Anyways, very happy with today's exercise session because uh, on pause bench I got 305 for four, which is pretty close to the best I've ever done. Uh, I've gotten 315 for three paused, so I don't think I'm too far off from that given the fact that this set of four wasn't exactly a failure. It was, I don't know if it was a true RP9 if I had another rep in, but it wasn't really a 10. So as you can see, my SMA one rep max is around 370, which I'm very happy with. We'll see how that comes to fruition over the next few weeks, months. I just did the one back offset here with 295 because my shoulder just wasn't feeling great and I didn't want to make any worse. So um, yeah, after that, moved on to sumo deadlifts. Started my ascent here with 585 pounds. This set felt pretty good. You can see here I'm not wearing a belt. I decided I'd go beltless today. I'm probably going to go beltless for the next couple weeks just on deadlifts and see how that goes. Uh, it felt really good though. So I went up to 600 here. My best 600 was for a set of three. It wasn't really till failure and that was a while ago. Here I got a really nice set of four here. Didn't feel great, but for me, I am realizing how much the belt really does help me you know I don't think it gives me a lot of weight but it's just very very helpful for me and kind of uh, gives me confidence I guess you could say so after that I dropped down just to 565 for another set of four and eh, this one wasn't great either after this I called it for deads and moved on to overhead press you may re remember that earlier I mentioned that my shoulder was bothering me and lucky for me my shoulder press never feels any deleterious effects from when my shoulder hurts from bench so I'm always able to overhead press. I've never actually been able to not overhead press despite the fact that I've had little you know nagging injuries to my shoulders so yeah I was able to press pretty well here and I managed to get a PR which you will see at the very, very end of this video. Um, I ramped up very slowly here because I kept on doing sets and it really felt good and I was I was asked, I was called for an RPE 9 and I didn't really reach that until my uh, new PR set of 210 for a set of four. So very, very happy with my overhead pressing and my pause benching today. It's a little bit annoying that my Heck, mine is bothering me. I've noticed that that's been happening actually the past two weeks, and it's actually from competition bench. Everything else, every other variation feels perfectly fine, but uh, the competition one just isn't feeling great. So, anyways, here's my max set here. You see, my max is 263. Um, just want to say thanks for checking in. Please hit the like button, uh, share, and subscribe to me. I'm going to get that video up about my programming uh, this week, and I look forward to talking to you again very soon. Take care. Peace.